I could give a list of lecture reasons I give and talks about this matter, but simply, I believe that expository preaching is so significant because 2 Timothy chapter 4, verses 1 and 2 come after 2 Timothy chapter 3, verses 16 and 17. The end of 2 Timothy 3 says, all scripture is breathed out by God and is profitable for teaching and rebuke and correction and instruction and righteousness. And it is on the other side of that, built on that foundation of the nature, the truth, the authority, the clarity, the sufficiency of God's word, that he issues this charge to Timothy to preach the word. My conviction is that how a man preaches betrays his conviction about the Bible. If the Bible is the word of God, there is no other faithful way to preach it than to seek to understand what the scripture means by what it says and to faithfully explain it to the saints of God and exhort them to live in faith and obedience. I really do think that expositional preaching is not just another style of preaching uh, that we can choose from and one chooses this way and one chooses the another way. I think exposition matters because preaching reflects convictions about the scripture. And I think that exposition is the most faithful way to let the word of God speak for itself.